What used to take me months and years takes me hours and weeks with very low stakes. I'm doing that in my office. I'm not doing that with, with the big apparatus. My name is Cutter Hodiern, um, and I'm the director of The Shepherd. It's a sci-fi horror film that follows Sixto, who's an alpaca herder who has an encounter with UFO. Using tools like Runway opens up the possibility that there is another way to find your story in the process. Cutter, he has an incredibly iterative way of working, and it allows him to take ideas that are in his mind and make them concrete so a team can see them. And then we can appropriately figure out how to make that real. I just organically started working with different AI tools, first with just text, then with image, then with runway. And I sort of was looking at this like feedback loop and it was so it slipped into my process in such a seamless way. He can explore how he wants to tell the story without incurring those costs to get a sense of the atmosphere he wants to capture in the movie. I was able to start looking at scenes in my script and putting them together and sort of pacing them out and ending up in the editing phase kind of much earlier in the process. Literally just by sort of pre-visualizing that scene, I started to to feel the pace of, okay, at this moment, there's going to be an eruption among the characters of, of, of violence. So he's able to discover things that he would ordinarily discover in post, and he's able to bring that to the very front of the process. So the movie is even closer to what he wants to make from day one. I kind of began my career with this fully self-reliant mindset. Werner Herzog talks about that being a filmmaker's best asset, being self-reliant. Then that broke me into Hollywood. Now there was sort of a certain way of doing things. There was a certain way that project had to get developed. And over the course of that process, runway and, and AI tools sort of grew into my life. And I, I started to have that control and have that sort of self-reliance back at my grasp. I was able to get a lot further along on my ideas for The Shepherd, like much, much earlier. Oh, yeah. Development can be incredibly time-consuming and, and resource-intensive. So as a, as a tool for pre-visualization, it's an incredible opportunity for him to not have to filter his ideas through multiple different collaborators. But I think with that, and with this in particular, how this tool allows us to very specifically visualize much freer worlds, much more ambitious storytelling, I think it allows more people to enter that space. The rarefied air of science fiction, world-building planets. I think the real opportunity is you expand the scope of what stories you might be able to tell. <laughs>